Yeah! It feels good to be back! What's up y'all, it's Alan the Sheriff back with another video and today we're gonna be talking about how to move the planet forward. But first, I have to ask you a serious question. How good does your eggplant taste? How good does your eggplant taste? Now, of course, the answer would depend on a number of things, from the farm that you brought it from, to the types of methods that were used to grow it, and the type of soil that was used. Well, kids, that's exactly what plays in today's conversation. Regenerative agriculture. Regina George. Regenerative agriculture. So what is it? In order to move the planet forward, we need to ensure that we have a healthy, mouth-watering, non-poisonous diet. And so regenerative agriculture is the practice that farmers use to keep the land that they grow food on healthy healthier and healthier every single year. Will you shut up? We need to provide food as quickly and cheaply as possible, and we're not gonna do that practicing Regina George. It's too time intensive. Can, can, can you complain about that in the comment section, please? <sighs> Now, regenerative agriculture has its pros and its cons, but we can actually begin to normalize the practice the more and more technology continues to improve. What's that? I got you hooked. You want to become more involved? Then go talk to this lady. Go talk to this lady. I certainly believe that addressing our food system is a very good place to start when we're thinking about how to tackle climate change this decade. Julia Collins is the founder of Planet Forward, or as it's spelled on the website, Wood. Now she started the company to source her ingredients from climate friendly farmers who practice regenerative agriculture. Now the thing is there are already companies and organizations that are doing this so what sets Planet Forward apart? All right I got an idea for the next great idea. All right what you got? It's tender but with farmers and consumers. How about we make the relationship more professional? Wh what? Let's connect people who make snacks to climate friendly farms. Where's the fun in that? You just want to meet girls don't you? Yes. She's not just trying to create a snack brand, she's actively trying to make business and farming practices more environmentally sustainable. And she's giving food producers a better source for their ingredients. She's gonna be the first company to do this. All in for healthy food. And what better way to celebrate moving the planet forward than to call the IRS about my stimulus check. Hello, we are not available now. Please leave your name and phone number after the beep. LIARS! Ending on a good note, I think this company has a bright future ahead of it. Not only is regenerative agriculture becoming more popular, but people are turning to more healthier alternatives. See, there's always going to be this huge divide between organic and conventional farming based on operational expenses and spacing, but I applaud Julia for being able to create a platform to give consumers access to climate-friendly focused farmers instead of just conventional ones. Thanks for checking out my video, guys. I really appreciate it. Make sure if you really like my content that you subscribe to my YouTube channel below. Make sure you thumbs up on this video if you really liked it. And make sure you comment below and let me know what cool industry, startup, or invention you want to hear me talk about next. All right, bet!